There are two types of positive displacement hydraulic pumps. A fixed pump, which produces a fixed gallon per minute flow based on the RPM of the prime mover or electric motor. And a variable pump, which can vary its rate of gallons per minute while the input RPM remain constant. Although displacement is typically measured in volume displaced per revolution, output is measured in gallons per minute or GPM. In this example, a motor turning at 1200 RPM is driving a fixed displacement gear pump producing 5 gallons per minute flow. The GPM can be changed if the RPM of the motor changes. When a variable displacement pump is used in the system, the GPM can be varied in two ways. As with fixed displacement pumps, the GPM will be changed if the RPM of the motor is changed. The second way is to vary the displacement of the pump. For example, the displacement of an axial piston pump is determined by the distance the pistons are pulled in and pushed out of the cylinder barrel. Since the swashplate angle controls this distance in an axial piston pump, we need only to change the angle of the swashplate to alter the piston stroke and pump volume. Several means of varying the swashplate angle are used. They may include hand levers, mechanical stops, or more sophisticated hydraulically positioned devices. If the pump produces 5 gallons per minute flow with 1200 RPMs at maximum displacement, the GPM can be varied by moving the swashplate into the upright position or de-stroking the pump. This will vary flow from 5 to 0 gallons per minute. Now that you have seen the animation in segments, you can click on Full Sequence to watch both kinds of pumps Click on the Fixed or Variable button to change the type of pump in the system. Then, experiment with varying the gallon per minute discharge and the speed of the flywheel by clicking on the different RPM settings. If you choose the variable pump, you can also vary the output by adjusting the displacement of the pump by moving the handle on the pump. The gallon per minute discharge of fixed The gallon per minute discharge of variable displacement pumps can be changed in two ways. The speed of the input drive can be increased or decreased, or the displacement of the pump can be adjusted or set to a specific volume.